A status call hearing was held this afternoon with the Civil Service Commission regarding the termination appeal of Leo Espia. Espia, a planner with Guam Homeland Security Office of Civil Defense, was terminated by Homeland Security Advisor Samantha Brennan in April of this year for what she said was unauthorized breach of GovGuam's network by installing a privately owned server without prior authorization by the agency. Espia filed a letter of appeal with the CSC on April 27th, stating that adverse action was taken without cause. OCD Administrator Charles Esteves sent a letter to the CSC on May 11th requesting to revoke Espia's notice of final adverse action, noting it was unlawfully initiated by Brennan and that she does not have the authority to do so. During the status call, Espia's lay representative Robert Koss and management representative Assistant Attorney General Donna Lawrence had a heated exchange over whether Esteves, who was present on the call, could speak. Lawrence claimed the, that Esteves did not have standing on the matter. When asked to comment on Brennan's actions, the governor's communications director, Crystal Paco Sinagasin, said the governor's office, quote, cannot comment on matters raised in the ongoing dispute before the CSC, end quote. Paco Sinagasin also said that Estevez is presently on military leave, saying upon completion of his military training, he may resume his duties as administrator of the Office of Civil Defense. Until such time, he is not acting as the administrator of the Guam Office of Civil Defense. The next status call hearing is set for Wednesday, June 1st at 2 p.m. Reporting for KUM News, I'm Jonah Goncharfras.